Hello and welcome to Mock Productions. You are here with me, Matthew, and we are back here <coughs> with the Incineral theme deck. Sorry about that. Um, we're here with the Incineral theme deck, and it is the last one from Sun and Moon. Quite a rare one to find in my case, um, but I did find it, and we've got it now, so we don't need to worry about it. It's an awesome-looking normal card, and the GX is even better, but it's an amazing pack to start off with. It really, really is. It's, uh, it's theme deck name is Roaring Heat. Uh, it's a fire and fighting deck, which is pretty sweet. And if it has a load of Persimians and Orangaroos, it's pretty much up my street, because I really like these two. Um, they've got some pretty good stuff to them, especially this guy. If you can uh, get uh, three of them on the bench, you're doing some pretty good stuff. And a Kukui. So, I've already opened it up, of course, um, and we're going to open this up and check out exactly what is in here. No back to this one either, which is odd. Very odd. So we've got our code there, which I'll put off to the side. We've, of course, got our Shatter Hollow of Mr. Incineroar. Mr. Mr. Angry Kitty. Hello, Mr. Angry Kitty. Very angry. But very cool indeed. Super, super awesome. Very awesome indeed. So that can go back there. Uh, we do get, of course, the theme deck box here. Just got Incineroar on it. Very, very nice. With Roaring Heat on the side. We then also have here, oh look at that, we have that beautiful Litten coin, that is awesome stuff. Very, very cool indeed. That is awesome. I'll give me two seconds and I'll show you the comparison between its, uh, its daddy. <laughs> so we've got this sort of like little uh, hint sheet at Sun and Moon. Damage counters, GX, poison and burn, and then a two player mat here. Great way to start off uh, with getting a pretty sweet mat, but... Speaking of Litten, we also want to see Mr. Incineroar coin next to it. Very, very cool indeed. Very nice. It's, it's really interesting to think that this thing evolves to that. <laughs> but it does. A cute kitten to a humongous tiger lion thing. Rawr. <laughs> so, the... Ah, uh, not my coin collection over. That was brilliant. Well done. Uh, so... <laughs> You obviously get the Litten Coin as well as that Shatter Hollow. We get a deck box full of cards, which I believe is 59. Pretty sure it is, anyway. So let's go through it. You're not expecting any GXs or anything like that. It's just going to be regular cards. So Fire Energy, Fire Energy, Fire Energy, more Fire Energy. Sandy Ghast, Fighting Energy. Torkoal, Nest Ball, Fire Energy. Litten, Timer Ball. Maku, flying Maku heater. Wow, that 9.5 there from the judges there. He did a triple, quadruple backflip there. Wow. That was insane. Maku heater, fighting energy, rog and roller, ultra ball, kukui, fighting energy, stuffle, boldor, fire energy, how, Toracat, lily, fight, fighting energy, timer ball, crabrawler, potion, fire energy, one persimian. Nest Ball, Fighting Energy, Energy Rabba Deba Deb Retrieval, Litten, Torkoal, Fire Energy, Rog and Roller, Fighting, Maku Heater, is it going to be a Harry Armor? Fire Energy, Boldor, Toracat, Fighting Energy, Big Malasada, Litten, Incineroar, <clears throat> uh, Fire Energy, Beware, Sandy Ghast, Palo Sand, Fighting Energy, Stuffle, Crab Roller, Fire Energy, Toracat, another Persimian, that's two. How, a Fighting Energy, and an Orangaroo, and a Litten to finish off. So one Orangaroo and two Persimians in there, with some evolutions there that don't have their... Final stage. Thanks, Litten. Little jumping cat he is. Um, yeah, so it's really interesting. I think I mentioned this in the Pre-Marina one as well. It's probably definitely uh, very much wise to go through that and scrap the ones that are useless. If it's an Incineroar deck, focus on Incineroar. You really want to make sure you've got all your Incineroars, your Littons, your Toracats, all in there. Um, you need something to go with it. Perfectly, it's saying to use Fighting. So if you can find any Persimians from a deck, definitely do that. Get rid of anything else. Stuffle, Crabrawler, Palo Sand, all of that sort of stuff can go. That can go. Um, that's a straight away saying that. Um, the Makuhiti, you haven't even got the Harry Armour, so there's no point having that. Persimian, though, focus on that. Maybe throw in an Orangaroo. Now, this one is a non-hollow one. Where is it? It's actually at the front. Uh, that one's a non-hollow one. 
But it's a good card. It is a very good card. It's very helpful. Very, very ha helpful indeed. That Psychic is really good, especially if you can get it powered up and maybe reverse like a Mewtwo deck. Obviously, if you're playing with this, mm, Mewtwo would probably much stump on your face there. But, very, very cool indeed. I like these theme decks a lot. You know, they are a definite good way to start off, but you definitely need to adapt them quickly with some awesome cards that you pull from your packs. You get an awesome coin, of course. You get that Shatter Hollow. And, of course, you get this amazing deck box, which I love these so, so much. They're so awesome. Very, very nice indeed. So, there we go. I'm going to leave it here for this video right here. Um, if you have enjoyed this, then make sure to hit that subscribe button below. You've had three videos today. You are lucky, lucky people. But, apart from that, I'll leave it here, like I said. And I'll see you guys in the next video on the channel.